So welcome back to Electric Vehicles channel my dear friends. I am Krishna Tinya Mandela. This is EV News 152 episode. On one side, central government is providing Natraj pencil worth subsidies. Whereas on the other side, companies are increasing Natraj geometry box rupees prices on their electric vehicles. And the best example is Revolt Motors. Earlier the price of Revolt RV400 is 1,7,000 rupees. Recently they increased the electric bike price by 18,000 rupees. The updated price of Revolt RV400 electric bike is 1,25,000 rupees. After the price hike on Revolt RV400, customers hope that at least they may want to increase the warranty on the electric bike. Instead, they reduce the warranty on their electric bike. Earlier they provided 1,50,000 kilometers or 8 years whichever comes early. Now they reduce that to 1 lakh kilometers or 6 years. And the reason for this price hike of Revolt RV400, simple, there is no competitor for RV400 currently available in India. And the second news, it's about Hero Electric. The company announced that their electric scooter business got 100% increased in 2021. Earlier, if you look at the electric scooter sales for the year 2020, from October 1st to November 15th, the retail sales were 11,339 units. Now in 2021 from October 1st to November 15th, the electric two-wheeler sales are 24,000 units, which is 111% growth rate. And the company claims the main reason for this electric vehicle sales. The first one, it's about the petrol prices hikes. And the second thing, it's about the fame to scheme increase subsidies. But the funny fact is, Hero Electric also increased their electric scooter prices close to 4,000 rupees to 5,000 rupees. So the three factors here, petrol prices increased, fame to scheme subsidies also increased. In addition to that, Hero Electric scooter prices also increased. And the third news, it's about Ola Electric. Ola Electric purchase window delayed once again. Earlier, the company announced that the purchase window to be opened on November 1st. Later, it got delayed to December 16th. Now it is further delayed to January 2022. And the fourth news, it's about Bharat Forge. Bharat Forge owned Kalyani Powertrain Limited got 60.66% stake in Torque Motors. So viewers already aware that Torque Motors is famous for the most awaited and most delayed electric bike Torque T6X. However, the Torque T6X is expected to launch in India by 2022 with the specifications of 100 km of range and 100 km per hour top speed. And the fifth news is about Hero Motor Corp. And most of the viewers already aware this thing. Hero Motor Corp cannot sell their electric vehicles under the brand name Hero. For that particular reason, Hero Motor Corp recently registered one new brand name for their electric vehicle segment. It is called as Vida. So under this Vida brand, the company is expected to launch their first electric scooter in March 2022. And this electric scooter is going to be a competitor for Ola electric scooter, Aether 450X, Bajaj Chetak and TVS IQ. And the next news, it's about a new EV startup in India. Gujarat based Greta electric scooters recently launched four electric scooters in the market. And the electric scooter model names Harper, E Vespa, Glide and Harper ZX. All these four models are no license, no registration electric scooters. Claims to have top speed of 25 to 30 km per hour. Works with a 250 watt BLDC hub motor. On a full charge, these electric scooters claims to give 70 to 100 km of range. Whereas the pricing of these electric scooters starts from 60,000 rupees and goes up to 92,000 rupees. And the next news is about TVS Motors. TVS Motors recently signed an MOU with Tamil Nadu government worth of 1200 crore rupees. This money is used to develop electric vehicles in future. And the next news it's about Greaves Electric Mobility. The company opened its largest electric vehicle manufacturing unit in Rani Pet, Tamil Nadu. It is a 35 acre manufacturing unit with a production capacity of 1,20,000 units. Greaves Cotton acquired Ampere Vehicles. And Ampere Vehicles is famous for electric scooters like Ampere Zeal, Ampere Magnus Pro and V48. And the last news, it's about BMW. The company recently announced that in India, the company to launch three electric cars in the next six months. The three electric cars, the first one is an SUV and the second model, it's a mini hatchback. And finally, the BMW i4. So viewers, you can share your local EV news with us. You can join our Telegram group. We will provide the link in the description. For general information about electric vehicles, please do subscribe to Electric Vehicle channel. For faster updates, please do follow our Facebook page and website. Go green, go electric.